Hi, today we're going to talk about running classic Amiga software. And um, if you take your pointer down to the Boeing icon bar and you right click, you have emulation there and we run Janus UAE. This is the emulator and everything is set up for you. Um, here we have uh, already hard disk partitions with system and work. Um, the good thing is that it's uh, free open source uh, Eros 68K rooms and, uh, and system. So uh, this is very compatible with uh, the original Amiga games and many demos and things. But um, I'm not running with JIT. You probably, if you don't know what JIT is, you can Google it up, but uh, that will make the emulator runs much, run much faster, but it will be less compatible with uh, classic games. That is, uh, first of all, what I interested in. And that is what uh, works really nice. Not tested so much software and things, but uh, I think if you're very interested in the classic Amiga software and not games, it's better to use the original uh, rooms and workbench. But here you see a ROS 68K. I use VHD load so you can get all your games on the hard disk. And um, here I'm just opening. Aladdin, AGA, and running that. You can see soon it's coming up this. And as usual, I'm holding my telephone with the right hand, so it's a little bit difficult doing any serious gaming with one hand, but this is just a proof of concept so start game yeah, yeah. you see that it works real nice no problems at all And in VHD load, sometimes you can quit with F10, sometimes not. If you take Amiga left key and M, you can multitask and you can just stop the emulator like this. And just start it again if it's problems with quitting any games or, yeah, or demos or whatever. But this setup is ready for you, of course, not with any games that you have to uh, find yourself with uh, and VHD load is uh, already set up, but yeah, you have to also go uh, there and find out how to install the games you like to try out. It's most games works really nice, just auto emulation, you don't really have to do any configurations, I would just leave it like it is. That's the best. And yeah, we can, this series is going to be uh, in many parts. Now I'm just showing you the proof of concept that everything works good. We can take one of my favorite uh, Super Stardust. Is it there? No, this is Street Fighter. Okay, this is also working, but... Now this is Super Stardust.
Starting now takes a little bit time, but it's much better than loading discs, right? <laughs> This is not easy. <laughs> but here with F10 it quits. So that's good. That is very good or not very good. Now I just started it a couple of times. Now it's okay. It's back. And you can start another game and Sensible World of Soccer works good. Um, and we have, uh, yeah, Worthy, Worthy, I mean, the new game for Amiga 500. It's real nice. If you have not already bought it, uh, you should buy it. Totally nice game. So, you know, I'm running circle exact, so it's not very fast, the system, but the important thing is that everything works as it should. Yeah, and it's worthy. And I have my trusty stick down there. Real nice graphics and real fun this game. So, okay, more to come. This is the first part of this uh, talking about Amiga emulation. Thank you, bye.